All right, exterior video here on Archer Road, Archer Drive, sorry, in Hope Mills, North Carolina. The house has got like a baby blue paint on it, a real light blue blue color with an almost a peachy trim. The trim's got to be painted. The body of the house, you might get away with not having to paint it. You could do some touch up on the back. Uh, it's a little dry in the video. I'm not sure if you can see that it's, you can see where the sun has baked it on this wall. But the paint is not in terrible condition, not a terrible color with white trim is what I imagine. All right, back to the, the just discovery on the house here. We've got a lot of fascia damage here, water damage. I'm assuming that's from roof leaks. It's the only thing I can think of. Uh, so we'd have to get the roof checked out. The roof doesn't look that old. So if it's not roof issues, you've got water penetration coming in from somewhere. So because we've got a couple soffits that are rotten, then we've got all this fascia damage. So I'm just taking some video of the soffit issue or fascia issues and then resulting soffit damage. All right. You go, we're just looking at the house here. We've got uh, the wood windows. They've been painted dark, almost like a black color. The windows have all been painted. Brickwork on the house looks very good condition. I'm trying to pan here for you. Our windows, we've got several rotten window surrounds. Back to fascia soffit issues. Okay. We've got a really nice train unit on the outside. This big package train unit. XL13C. It appears to be an electric package unit. There's no gas lines coming into it. Nice unit. I looked for a date on it. I could not find a date. All right. Back to the side of the house. We're on the right-hand side of the house here. Again, windows have been painted a dark color. Fence is going to need some repairs. You see the gate here is hanging by a thread. It's about three full panels here wide on this side. Got our crawl space entry. Melissa is saying new screens. All right. Looks like this is where the AC unit used to be because there's a little pad here and there's a hole there where the line set went. So it looks like it used to be a uh, two-piece unit and has been replaced with a package unit. So I'm not sure if the old air, air handler is still inside the house or not. Probably not. The closet there in the hallway that's built out as a linen closet, that was more than likely the home of the air handler at one time. And now they've got a package unit, so there's no air handler in the house. I would call that a definite upgrade. Okay, we're still just panning around the outside of the house here. Gable looks really good. And the fascia on this side actually looks pretty good shape. 